I can't believe I'm, do, I'm about to do this video. Greetings YouTube, this is Lord Von 216 here again with another hot sauce review. Today, <laughs> I am doing a review, I am going to be doing a review of Nutaku.net's Triple X Rated Hentai Hot Sauce. I'm only showing this for a brief second because it is a little NSFW. A buddy of mine sent me a link to this and it was an impulse buy. I I had to buy it. It was just too good to pass up. It was freaking hilarious. So, and the, the slogan for the hot sauce is, fuck me, it's so hot. <laughs> so, I had to. Plus, I haven't done a review for you guys in a while, so I figured, eh, why not? So, real quick, let's get a quick view of the, uh, view of the label. It's very, very risque. Fuck me, it's so hot. Uh, refrigerate after, after opening and visit Nataku.net. Um, obviously, if you're below the age of 18, uh, 18, I would not recommend that. It's an adult site. Um, I tried to see if there was another website I could actually order this from, but it was the only site available. One thing I will say about the website, they actually sent it in some uh, discreet packaging. There was nothing on the envelope or the box or anything like that, so that was great. Um, ingredients. Selected hot peppers. Those hot peppers include habanero, chipotle, ghost peppers, scorpion, and Carolina reaper. Apple juice, apple sauce, cider vinegar, carrots, onions, maple syrup. That's going to be interesting. Tomato paste, garlic, salt, and spices, and xanthan gum. So, relatively normal stuff you would find inside of uh, hot sauces. But the one that threw me for a loop was the maple syrup. Uh, shake well, refrigerate after opening. I've already said that. Here's the uh, dietary, uh, dietary facts on it, if you really care about that. Um, so, yeah, not putting it off. Let's go ahead and uh, crack it open and see what we think. Yeah, like I said, I originally bought this as like a, just a novelty, uh, a novelty thing. Um, my buddy was actually supposed to be coming up to uh, review this with us. But, uh, unfortunately, he's uh, actually stuck downstate in the, you know, because of a car accident. This looks like it's actually a pretty thick sauce. So that's an A plus, uh, a plus in my book. You can see the seeds, you can actually see like seeds and flakes. So the sauce looks actually pretty gnarly. Let's see how it smells though. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> Wrong context me saying that for this video. Also said thick sauce. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Here. Just just smell this. Ooh. Yeah. It smells like hot. It smells like I'm going to die. <laughs> Alright, so I've actually got a little uh, microwave burrito with me to try it out on, so let's see the consistency of this. It's a little, it's smooth, but it looks like it's also a little, it's a little thick. Alright, so I've got myself a, a nice little dollop there. So let's see if I can get this. I apologize, I lost my tripod for this. So let's move the bottom all the way, bottoms up. It's not, it's not that bad. Try it with your finger. No, I'm actually going to get a spoon for this one. I'll be right back. So normally when I do hot sauces, I like to try and, um, if you see my past reviews, I like to try and review them with uh, food. Because, I, you know, it's a condiment. It's supposed to be added with food. But this one, it doesn't have a lot of heat to it. It's a little bit of a tingle. But I actually want to be able to taste the, uh, the sauce for what it is, too. So I'm not going to be doing a whole spoonful, but I will be doing another little dollop of that. Oops. So, like I said, just a little bit. Just enough to get the, fla uh, get the flavor and the heat of it. So, bottoms up. That's not a bad sauce. It's really not 
that's really actually really really good it's not that spicy I mean it's got heat to it and it's slowly building up but it's not something that I can't handle that's a really good sauce it's a little sweet because you can tell from the uh, you can almost, if you really, really try and look for it, you can kind of taste the maple syrup that's in it. But unless you're like really trying to concentrate on it, it's not necessarily, it, you can't really pick up on it. When it hits your stomach, you can feel it though. But no, that's not a bad sauce. That's, I'd say that's about, I've had hotter sauces made with the Reaper and the Scorpion. So I wouldn't say this is one of the hottest sauces I've tried. But as far as flavor goes, this is actually one of my, this is, I would actually put this pretty high up on the list for flavor. Very good, very smooth, a little sweet, but it's got the, uh, it's got the heat to it too. Normally with uh, Carolina Reaper sauces and uh, ghost sauces, you get a little bit of smokiness. No, this one's just very smooth and a little sweet. I, I give it a thumbs up. I'd say it's pretty good. I was hyping myself up, uh, hype, hyping myself up about this sauce for nothing. I was thinking, oh, you know, because it's made with every single sauce I've had with Reaper has been nothing but blistering heat. But you know what? Props to Notaku, if I'm even pronouncing that right. Props to them. They actually made a very delicious sauce. So this is something I am actually going to be using. I'm not. I mean, this is not something I'm going to be able to take to my work lunches or anything like that. This is something that's purely going to be at home. But I actually would not mind picking up another bottle of this once it runs out. It's very good. So, yeah, two thumbs up. I highly recommend it. Um, if you want a gag gift for an anime, uh, anime fan or any sexual deviant that you know of, or you just want a good comedy gag hot sauce to get somebody, definitely pick this up. It's really, really good. I'd recommend it to anybody. But, damn it. Yeah, this has been uh, my review of uh, Nutaku.net's Triple X Rated Hentai Hot Sauce. Uh, if you like the video, feel free to subscribe for more content. I'm hoping to be doing more content within the next coming months. I want to try starting to get back into cigar reviews. I know I've said this with the last couple of videos I've done, but I'm uh, but I am going to be trying. One thing I am, uh, I can say is that in November I have a very 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 cool unboxing video that I'm going to be doing. I'm not going to spoil anything, but if you've been subscribed to my channel long enough, you might be able to guess what it is, judging by my past content. So keep an eye, uh, keep an eye out for that. Let's just say that it's going to be one hell of an unboxing. So yeah, that's my review for the hot sauce. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, liked it. Leave a comment down below of what you guys thought. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe. Leave a comment down below, and I'll see you all next time.